What's good, YouTube? This your boy Chi World back to y'all again with another art tutorial, man. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that like button, comment, subscribe. Make sure you click post notifications so you will be notified every time your boy drop some heat. In today's video, I will be teaching you guys how to become better at just flat out drawing. Main thing you want to focus on to become a better artist, all around artist, is practice and practice on your weaknesses and train your eye you know what i'm saying because all it is is copying exactly what you see so the more you train your eye and try to make it as accurate as possible you know what i'm saying over time you'll become a better a better artist so practice repetition and you gotta stick to it man you gotta stay grinding so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to copy this picture I found on Pinterest. It got a shade on one side of the face and that'll be good, you know what I'm saying, to uh, start out with this picture. So, first thing we're gonna do is find us a little pencil. And I always start out like with the color pink. You know what I'm saying? When I'm doing the sketches, I just like it. Um, so, what we're going to do is we're going to try to copy the shape of everything. You know what I'm saying? And we're going to slowly bring in the detail. You know what I'm saying? So, we're going to copy exactly what we see. So, right now, what I'm doing, I'm just... I'm just mapping everything out. And we're gonna clean it up later, but one thing we, we're trying to get get everything in the right proportions. And the more you do this, like if you just pick some time to practice daily, eventually you'll just like give it a year. You'll just become like a a beast. So you'll see a big dramatic improvement in your art. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta practice. Just like all the NBA players, when you be watching them, you be like, dang, how is he so good? How can Kobe just go score 50 points? We only see the games. We don't see the times them boys spend, them men spend hours in the gym. When practice over, they still in there practicing. You know what I'm saying? They still in there putting up shots, lifting weights, running miles, getting up early. You got to do the same thing if you serious about becoming a better artist. You know what I'm saying? The key is you can never stop learning. So if you can never stop learning, you always can get better. You know what I'm saying? So just practice. You gotta stay practicing, stay focused, and you gotta have some confidence. I know a lot of people when they when they message me, they I hear a lot of folks say, "I'm not as good as you. I'm not. I'm not. I can't. I can't." They already going at it with a with the wrong mindset. You gotta all automatically have some type of confidence about yourself like i'm gonna get there you know what i'm saying never say nothing negative about what you're doing because you got to start from somewhere just like i did like i don't i'm not truly the best artist but i got confidence in myself like i know i can draw anything and i can get better and become the best artist because that's my goal you know what i'm saying but you got to stay you gotta stay positive, man. And you gotta stay grinding. You gotta always work. So what I'm doing, I'm just, I'm going back and I'm trying to get it as close as I can with the original picture. Just 
slowly, slowly add in the detail. Just slowly add it in. And, that, and this is how you train, you train your eye. Just by looking at the picture and just adding piece by piece the details you see. And kind of focus on one section, like see right here, I'm just focusing. Like every time I stroll down, I focus on one section. And then I go to that one section on my picture. Then I ease my way down, focus on this section. Then I just do the same thing. You gotta, you gotta do it piece by piece. It's like a, like a puzzle. Then I see areas that can be switched. And when you're working on your sketch, don't be afraid to erase and get it right. Just keep going back and forth, getting it right until you finally got it looking exactly how you see it see it post to look from your reference you use I see I gotta make this face come out a little a little wider my face is too slim that's what I'm noticing to this nose so we're going to try to make ours come over make it come over you just keep going and as you keep going you just keep building
all you need to do, guys, is just to practice, man. Just stay practicing. Also, remember, shading is a part of drawing, too. So, just like we're trying to train our eyes to see the line work, you got to train your eyes to see where the shadows at, where the, where the uh, light tones at, where the dark tones at, and you just piece it together slowly. So, all we're doing right now is just, we just practicing. And the more you do this... Trust me, you will see a big improvement in your, your art. And you'll just overall become a better artist the more you practice. You can't just say you want to be the best. You got to go out there and work. You know what I'm saying? Put some work in. That's why I be saying, we're telling y'all to grind. And if y'all was wondering, did I go to school for art? Nah, I'm self-taught, just blessed with a gift. You know what I'm saying? But just like anything, you still gotta work. Even if you even if you blessed with natural talent, you still gotta work at it. Taught, never went to school for it. That's all you do, like when you're drawing, you just piece together all the detail slowly, right? and then your picture slowly come together. You just slowly build and draw exactly what you see, like train your eye.
there you have it you guys a little practice all you got to do is make sure you get you some practice in daily you know what i'm saying train your eyes to draw exactly what you see and just you'll get better in time man more heat coming soon make sure you stay tuned i'm out this thing